As I proved earlier in the show tonight, the 2016 presidential election has been full of twists and turns and excitement, and also John Kasich. <laughs> Things are looking bleak for the Ohio governor. Not only is he trailing Donald Trump and Ted Cruz in the delegate count, he's still behind Marco Rubio, <laughs> who dropped out of the race five weeks ago. It's like the old saying, quitters never win, but they still beat John Kasich. <laughs> but instead of giving up, Kasich's super PAC recently unveiled the most optimistic ad I have ever seen. And I just want to stress to everyone out there, what you're about to see is an actual ad. And the GOP nomination for president goes to John Kasich. What a long, fascinating trip it's been. How'd it go from the final three to the one the establishment didn't think could win? Well, running for president isn't about the establishment. In the final hours, it came down to 1,237 brave Americans. Delegates, you, who overcame tremendous personal pressure and did the right thing. They nominated the only candidate who could win the only election that mattered. The candidate who was presidential, John Kasich. Yes. A commercial showing John Kasich winning the GOP nomination. As long as they're fantasizing, they should have made his vice president that pizza that comes in a box made of pizza. <laughs> You'd get the youth vote and the stoner vote. And I say, why stop at the nomination? I can imagine an ad that's even more optimistic. In fact, I already have. President John Kasich, what a long, strange trip it's been. How did he go from third place in the 2016 Republican primary to the most successful five-term president in American history? Through charisma that can only be gained by years of eating deli meat. And after Barack Obama resigned early to make way for President Kasich, he balanced the budget, defeated ISIS, and repelled the spider beasts from space. Then, with only three seconds left, he threw the winning pass in the Super Bowl, a pass caught by John Kasich. He won the Oscar for Best Supporting Actor and was crowned Pope. So don't listen to the establishment who say John Kasich has no chance of becoming president. They were the first to be devoured by the Spider King, Xanthon. Paid for by Spider Beast for Kasich. Hail Xanthon! Now, we made some of that up. <laughs>